What's up guys, I'm Baker and you're in the bakery. Now this week, I've sent Bo out to a very, very special event, the Coranda Roots Festival. So we're gonna go see what he came up with. Apparently Ash Gromwald's there. He's gonna get the inside scoop. Bo, what have you got? Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Baker, and we're coming live from the beautiful World Heritage listed rainforest, the Coranda Amphitheatre, where we're going to get one with Mother Earth. That's right, we're going to get right involved. Mm. That's right, guys, the ground up here is awesome. We've got some awesome acts coming up thanks to the Coranda Blues and Roots Festival. We've got some great acts thanks to our good friends Ash Grumwell, one of the headliners today as well. We've got the Nomad all the way from New Zealand. We've got some local acts called Zenith. We've got some Huckleberry. We've got heaps of good acts all day throughout the whole day and evening tonight, guys. Stick around because we're going to bring you some freaky shit today. We've got lots of interviews, lots of people to meet, and lots of fun to have. So stick around, guys. We're here at the Coranda Blues and Roots Festival. All thank you to the bakery. That's right, guys. We're still at the Coranda Blues and Roots Festival. Going to introduce you to a good friend of ours from Time Out, Mr. Jess. How is the night going and the day going for you so far? Mate, it's awesome, mate. Love uh, Coranda Roots. So it's best one of the best outdoor events up here. So, yeah, that's no, really cool, eh? Sweet. You're the ins and outs of all the love up here as well. You do a lot of articles and a lot of you. You've got a lot of support for all these people and the local acts as well, man. It's really good to have you around in town and stuff as well. Yeah. Are you here all night? Yeah, man, I'll be here right till the end, hey, and probably till after. But, um, yeah, no, we love to support it here at that time out. So, cool, that's, man. Sweet. We're going to see you. Absolutely, brother. We're going to see you. We're going to see you stomping out here as well. Because we are at the dub stage, ladies and gentlemen. And guess what? That's Billy Dread. Yeah. I worry about the future. Are we ever going to find our way? I don't even realize that we're living in the good old days. I don't think I'm so Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are with a bakery. It doesn't get much more personal than this. We're in the back of Ash Grumwald's camper van, ladies and gentlemen. Ash, welcome to the Grand and Blues and Roots Festival. Thanks, brother. Yeah, is this your first time up here in the amphitheatre? No, no, I've done it once before. And uh, when I did it, I went, this is amazing. This yeah. is sick. I want to do this again. I want to, you know, so it's, that was probably maybe about three or four years ago. Yeah, so okay, it's yeah, cool. Sweet, sweet. Nice. Yeah. And you're glad to be back again? Yeah, yeah, yeah really. Yeah, you're really. really glad, yeah. Now, this little tour, you've been doing a bit of touring since uh, late May and all early June and stuff, yeah? Yeah. Uh, releasing your new album, yeah? Tell yeah, us a little bit about yeah. this oh, one. Fish Out of Water. It was... I released it kind of last year, but I just like did one lap of Oz and then went and did a whole lot of overseas yeah, stuff and that. Yeah. And then this was just like the last little lap before yeah. I go overseas again. Yeah. Cool. Now, like, I'm a big fan of the whole slide guitar stuff as well. We've got some great favourites, of course, as you know, Xavier Rudd and John Butler as well. But you definitely have your own unique style as well, man. Um, I did read a little bit about you. Uh, a lot of your influence, you used to play around a lot with your grandfather um, and you used to do a lot of jamming as well as on top of that. Um, but, yeah, like, obviously you said he was an influence on you. What other bands and other influences do you actually have throughout your life and childhood uh, history? <laughs> yeah. Wow. <Well, laughs> that's a long question. Uh, uh, just lots of bluesy stuff. Um, uh, lately, I've been listening to... I don't know, I've been doing band stuff and doing more beats driven stuff, so yeah. I've been listening a lot wider, yeah. like to a lot of hip hop and just, you know, Fat Freddy's and yeah. the streets and just bizarre things. I always listen for the lyrics as well. Yeah, yeah, cool. uh, but, you know, musically, I guess it all comes from a blues kind of background. Yeah, absolutely, yeah, sweet, sweet. Yeah, nice, nice. Now, you've actually had a lot of uh, nominations in the ARIA Awards as well, and you actually uh, won like best album, Blues and Roots album of the year too, didn't you? Was that 2003? And the MBAS uh, Awards, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, that was a blues one, but yeah. uh, not an aria. It'd be good to get an aria one yeah, day. That'd be sick. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> man, you've been growing around town and all, all of the world, and man, you really, really uh, stepped the pace up with uh, your name as well. Us Grunwald's coming a big, big, big statement in, uh, especially Australia, man. So it's really, really good. Now you are from Melbourne, is that right? You base yeah. yourself there. Yeah. yeah, yeah, cool. Do you do a lot more, more, more travelling, or you got like a whole home base there as well, or? Uh, no, well, I do have a home base there in uh, Torquay on the Torquay, the beach there, yeah, but I probably player. this year spent not even <laughs> maybe two weeks there. Yeah, okay, yeah, sweet. <laughs> so it's been, yeah, yeah, but that's how's the camper van like holding up, man? Yeah, good, yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Banana's been hanging out there for a while. Yeah, that's all right. I know they created a bit of a stench <laughs> after a bit of a week, but no, it's all right. Yeah, Get a blender, brother. We make some seedy. wicked, wicked <laughs> smoothies. Hey, it's really good for your uh, vocals as well. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, Sue's <laughs> even the savage beast that does. Yeah. Hey, you are playing a bit later on as well. Are you a bit excited about that? Yeah, it's going to be sick enough. Yeah, we're real excited. Yeah. 
yeah, I did solo last time here, but it's good to, yeah, bring a band up. Awesome, so that'd be pretty awesome. cool. Yeah. Well, we're definitely looking forward to that, guys. He's kicking off around about the 7 o'clock mark, guys. Stick around. We are here at the Grand Blues and Roots Festival. Thanks, courtesy of the bakery. Take care. This is Ash Gronwald. Give a peace out there, brother. Thanks for taking your time. We are in his camper van rocking the shit. <laughs> oh, for you freaky people out there. Yeah, we love it. Uh, that's right, guys. We're kicking out the front of the main stage with the main headline today. Mr. Ash Grunrold here at the Coranda Roots Festival, coming to your bakery style. God, that was a wicked coverage, bro. Thank you so much for getting the inside scoop. Ash Grimald, your trailer was messy, bro. You gotta clean that shit up. Well, guys, that's it. I'm Baker. You're in the bakery. We'll see you next time.